A watershed event in the history of India's space program. India will launch a mind-boggling not one, but ten satellites through this indigenous polar satellite launch vehicle. Given the number, it's a challenging mission for the Indian Space Research Organization as this week core alone PSLV rocket will have to eject the satellites in orbit at the right time and the right angle one after another. The cluster of satellites includes the latest remote sensing satellite Cartosat 2A equipped with a high resolution camera and would be used for mapping or spying. The Cartosat 2A aside, the PSLV will also place in orbit the Indian Mini Satellite 1. And of course, eight nano satellites built by universities and research institutions in Canada and Germany. The feat will be especially remarkable given India's humble beginnings. Back in the early 60s, even as the rest of the world was preparing to reach the moon, India was slowly awakening to the space age. A small rocket took off from Sumba on the outskirts of Tiruvananthapuram, announcing the birth of the modern space age in India. That was the stepping stone to the launch of the country's first satellite, Aryabhat, into the space in 1975. And then came this most memorable moment, India's first cosmonaut, Rakesh Sharma, orbits the moon in 1984. And as India sets the bar higher, the scientists at ground control will not be thinking of the past, but will be anxious about the job at hand. With your inputs, Pavitra Ramaswamy for Times Now.